Bessel Fountain heat exchanger, steam condenser. Yeah, do you see that nice bubble it's actually finally starting to do? I want it to be bigger, but I got electronics over here. But for now, this nice flashing on the walls of the metal basin, that'll help mix it with the air. The pump down over there, that circulates all the water from the condensers, all through the condensers and back up into here. So that there's the cooling one for simulating the biomass boiler. We're just doing a propane water heater and that'll go to heat up the boiler and heat exchangers for the superheater. So from the boiler, it goes through the superheater, up through here, up through the tubes, into the turbine, out of the turbine, through the holes in the table that go into the condensers and from the condensers down into the condenser tank. And it gets those up, that pushes it back into the boiler. And it keeps circulating and that just adds the heat. That takes the heat out, puts the heat in, makes electricity, and anything that doesn't make electricity goes out into the air. Or before that, you use it for heating or hot water or whatever. I've seen the fountain get up to 130 degrees, 140 degrees Fahrenheit. That's still hot water temperatures, or at least showering temperatures. That'd be really hot showers. What do you think, Tesla? Thumbs up, thumbs down, thumbs up, thumbs down. I don't know, he's been working on that part forever.